Hello everybody and welcome to another video from make a website for feedblog.com It's been a while since I made, I made a video and today I wanted to do one on a subject that I um, ran into a problem the other day and I wanted to get a image that I found online that was pretty big and I wanted an image to fit on my uh, Facebook page and um, I know when you upload something to Facebook page you can kind of move the image around especially in the profile section um, not the profile section in the um, timeline um, in the cover in, in, in the cover the cover section of it uh, the cover page you'd be able to kind of move the image around and kind of kind of line it up where you want it but um, I didn't want to do that I wanted to get the image just right and I wanted to find a a, uh, a, a resizing tool or resize resizing software. So I went online and typed in this uh, typed in um, uh, free online image resizer uh, without losing quality, and I came across a pretty neat site. It's called uh, Pick Resize. Uh, once again, it's called Pick Resize. P I C R E S I Z E. And what this tool does is allow you to um, upload a picture that you have, an image that you have on your computer, stored on your computer, and it allows you to resize this image quickly and easily. Um, this tool is so easy, it's uh, a no-brainer. And I've, you know, I've, I mean, I've never been, I've never used one like this before or had the need to look for one, but since I needed one and I, you know, went online and looked for it, I found it, so I decided decided to share it with you guys just in case you guys have images that you want to put on your website you may know the size but for some re weird reason um, it can't fit in the space on the site where you want it or you know wherever you want to put an image um, here if you know the size here's a tool that will help you do just that you'll be able to resize it you can even print the image out um, but make sure you you have permission to use the image if you're gonna do it in print, um, and and it, it's free. It's a it's a free free image. Um, so once it, without further without further ado, um, here goes. Now again, I said the site is called uh, Pick um, uh, Pick Rise. So it's P I C R E S I Z. So it's very straightforward. There's a browse button. We're gonna hit that browse button. We'll look for the image on the site, on my computer rather. Um, I have the image here ready. I'm just gonna go get this image. Uh, once it's here, it's gonna show up in the uh, in the bar. You're gonna hit continue, resize, crop, and special effects. And here's my image. My image is here. All I'm going to do now is I can make my image a little smaller. Um, currently, the image is 851 by 315, or 851 pixels by three, three 851 pixels wide by 315 pixels high. Now, for you, for you, for you guys who want to make your Facebook page and you want to know the size of the image, that goes in. That goes in this section right here. Um, this is the size for it: 851 by 315. All right, so I can make that image a little smaller. So all I have to do is resize your picture, make my picture 50% smaller, or I want to do a customize. Say, for instance, the image that you had was like a thousand by you know 900, and you want to get to a certain size. You just go to customize my size, and where it says width, you're gonna type the number that you want there. So this I'm gonna do 800 pixels by 300 pixels wide. So 800 pixels high wide by 300 pixels high. All right. Don't do the percent. Forget about the percent. Do the pixels. Alright, I'm just going to come down. Don't bother checking any of these boxes down here. 
um, you can add a frame. Uh, let's add a let's add a frame. That's what it does. Um, we can have rounded edges. Um, we can add a Polaroid image effect to it. Wow, some of these are really cool. Um, you can have a blur image. You can have a scorch, warm, a Polaroid effect, a sharp spread. See all the effects we can put with our image. All right. Let's tr let's see which one we can use for our image here. Let's try the. Let's try the um. This is the wall painting. Maybe the tilt. Okay, let's try the tilt shift. All right. Let's go and resize our image. And here we can, we can look at our image. What our image looks like. Here's our image. It looks a little weird because I added this, um, whatever that style was. So the image looks a little strange. Um, but without this effect that caused the image to look a little strange, just pick none. All right, don't choose any of the effects that were that's there. Um, we're gonna try to go back and see what happens. All right, my image well it disappeared. Um, so we're gonna browse again. We're gonna browse again and get our image again. Um, Bellagio. We're gonna continue. We want to do um, customize image 851 pixels by 315 pixels and again this is the size of your Facebook uh, page and we're going to choose special effect we're going to pick none we don't want any special effects on our um, you, you know you, you can do one if you like this is what it looks like we can just hit up uh, Put a border around it, um, and that's it. Let's put a border. And here's a JPEG. One of PNG. Let's see. One of PNG. And I'm just gonna view my image. We add a border to it, and there's a border on our image. It's our border, and again, you don't have to use this border around the image. Um, I just added it just to use the special effects. Um, and there's our there's our image. So again, um, the free tool to get your image resized is called p i c r e s i z e dot com. Once again, I want to thank you so much for watching this video. And if you have any questions, please feel free to ask. And again, if you have an image that you want to resize, want to get it to fit in a particular area of your site, and for some reason, if you're using WordPress, uh, that should work for you. If it's not working at all, and you really want to resize the image to fit, um, please come to the site and uh, resize the image. It's free. Um, and have a wonderful day, and thank you for watching.